So in my bio, I have listed as one of my specializations, OT cybersecurity specialist. And the key word there is the OT part, right? So OT stands for operational technology. And now the word operational technology exists, the term exists specifically as opposed to being someone in information technology. Now, I just wanted to run through a uh, little ebook that I created that has all the information. It's called Operational Technology um, Ultimate Guide for Engineers. And I've made it available for free on the website at engineeringinreallife.com where I'll send you guys a link. But the key there is that I go through some key topics for you and that should encapsulate everything to do with operational technology. Now, one of the key things that I want to do in this channel is I'm going to do a video series on operational technology that'll go through some key topics that you may be interested in when you're thinking about what is operational technology. So, what is operational technology? Well, in short, operational technology is the IT stuff for industrial computer systems. It covers the hardware and software that monitors and controls changes in physical devices. Industrial control systems don't just mean, you know, a computer and networking hardware and software. It also includes the processes and the instrumentation, um, which focuses on the logic and operations. Now, those working in information technology would be familiar with some of the networks and the systems that are used in um, operation and operational technology environments, but they wouldn't know how to configure the controls and the logic, and they also wouldn't really understand the impacts on industrial control systems. The only thing they're interested in is the interfacing. So a good way to think about the IT versus OT is that information technology is focused on information, whereas operational technology is focused on operations and processes. So what's this mean? It means that even though they use the same technology to meet some of their goals, the implementation of that technology is different to suit the different priorities. Operational technology needs to keep running. They need to keep going 24 seven. You can't simply reboot a machine. Otherwise, the power goes out. In this guide for engineers, what I go through is some key questions, operational technology, the system architecture, cybersecurity, addressing IIoT, um, jobs and risk. Now I hope I can help engineers understand operational technology because it is critical to the industries that we work in. Now I hope that brief overview gave you something to work with, something to think about, and if it helps, Go to, go to the website, get that ultimate guide, that's the starting point, and then look out for the content that's going to be coming to this, to this uh, channel. Just subscribe, you'll get all the notifications for when that playlist comes up and for each video that comes up, because I'm going to do a series on that, um, so don't forget to do that. And if you've liked what you've listened to today or you found anything informational that you know, could be useful to you or could be useful to another engineer, please like the video and if you'd like to see more and thought this was pretty good, subscribe, it really helps and see you in the next one.